Police Department, Pat Janeski. Hey, uh, anybody in the room that shouldn't hear things? Warwick. Uh, this crash out here is Josh Kuiper from the prosecutor's office. It's hammered going the wrong way on Union and plugged a parked car. Stop. 3407. All right. You gotta you gotta put three four zero seven in your uh, cell phone now. I shall do that. As the number to call. It's a non <laughs> What do you got? Ah, uh, gotcha. Josh Kuiper from the prosecutor's office. Wrong way. Visibly intact. Says he's intact. As I approach, driving the wrong way, and she bought the parked car. There was a guy getting into the car at the time who got knocked to the ground. Not sure on injuries at this point. How much of this is on ICV and body cam? Uh, me, I, I didn't recognize him at first, and he's like, oh, man, I'm really sorry. I was going the wrong way. I'm Josh. I'm from the prosecutor's office, so plenty of it. It's all on there? Yeah. Um, sobriety, how's he going to do? Probably not amazing. PBT? No, nope, he's just standing on the curb right now, away from me. Who else is there? Mm, just some other people on the street and some firefighters, just me. Can we do sobrieties and go from there? And yeah, I can do that. Let's, let's pass them. If we can, if we can't, we can't, Adam. We're not going to get fucked. No, 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 I get it. I get it. Yeah. I'd, I'd like to pass them on sobriety if we could. All right, I'll do what I can. All right, call me back in 07. All right, sounds good. Okay. Bye. Hi, Manhole. Hey. Not amazing? Like, yeah, I don't know. Um, I, we're, we're kind of way out. Um, we're probably going to have to. Is there, any way okay. we, is there any way we can get around not doing it? I mean, if he's drunk, is it a P.I.? Yeah, well, some dude was getting in the car and got – he didn't get hit directly, but either – he was he was trying to get in the passenger of the driver's door of his car, and him, Josh was going the wrong way on this one way and hit his car and put it up onto the curb and, like, knocked him down. So he's complaining of neck, back, head pain, that kind of thing. Yeah, we're going to have to, aren't we? Yeah, I think so. I don't want to be in a trick bag, but um, – Me, Neither do I. Well, you won't be in the trick bag because it all falls to me. Um, well, no, I, I know. I get it. I, we were just talking about this, too. Um, yeah. uh, Tommy, put him on a PBT, and hopefully he's low. All right. The best we can do, but. You want you want Tom to run that, or you want me to? Uh, you two decide. I trust both of you, so. Okay. Um, as he got through the alphabet, hand dexterities were okay. He said he couldn't do the one foot stand because his knees were not great, so I skipped that one. And then we did walk and turn, which wasn't awesome at all. So I've got two that were passable, one that wasn't good. Okay. Um, how much has everybody seen there? They're they're way down tending to this other guy. Okay. <laughs> Talk to do, do do the people say anything about yeah he's drunk look at him or anything like that? I, I haven't I haven't got a chance to talk to them. Once I recognized who he was, I kind of pulled him off to the side and I'm going through this stuff. So I'll go down there and kind of test those waters a little bit too. Tom just pulled up, so I'll talk to okay. him and we'll go. Put that to a crawl and we're gonna have to do what we have to do, but No, I get it. All right, I'll let you know how things are going. Thank you. You're welcome. So no, that's the bad part.
Sure. Um, wow. We, uh, we got him home. He's fucked up. He's fu- he was fucked up. But Adam did a good job. Um, we, uh, we blasted this fucker. God, God damn it. And he's, um, hang on one second. He's still working on, um, oh, perfect. Okay. All right, thanks. Um, so yeah, he's, he's going to get a ticket for driving the wrong way on a one way. Okay. Um, and then that's it. I have been drinking on the CD10. Okay, yep. Yeah, we can't lie about that. Uh, no. PBT or no? We did not offer a PBT. Adam said he I had, he did okay on his Fridays, I guess. Okay. Um, I wasn't there for that. But when I was with him, I really didn't smell a lot of alcohol. Okay. So I told Adam, um, you know, whatever, and he's like, yeah, I don't smell it either. He did pretty good. He didn't do the um, – he did, I think he, well, I don't know how, all that was on the body cam, so. Um, and then I actually dropped him off at that house over on Cobb, and he's in that back seat with my thing down, and I didn't smell it, so. Um, but. Okay. Um, you should probably write a report. Pretty much totaled. What's that? Did you probably write a report? Did I? Yeah. I can. Yeah, why don't you, and be honest, say you were in here. Um, Adam called you out to that scene. Don't obviously say why. It'll be obvious and that you were sent out there to uh, assist with the accident if you want. I mean, just to – I mean, is more, cut more paper on it a good idea or no? You tell me. You're the – I don't know. I'm thinking. I mean, you were there and you – I transported him. Yeah, just like that. Do we want to go over the top? No. Uh, no. I mean, no, you're right. by me writing something, I'm almost – well, you almost have to write something. No, here, put it on your log. Adam. Just put it on your log, assisted Adam. Yeah. Okay. Um, and I'll tell Becker in the morning about it. And that way, I can say from um, memory, I can be like, no, I, I, no, shit, no, the guy didn't smell like alcohol. I brought him home. Okay. Versus cutting paper on it. Which may, which we don't normally do. No. Okay. I'm not gonna just yeah. See, it's a good thing you're here. Yeah. Talk to me out of shit. What do you think would happen if our old lieutenant was here? Holy shit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, All the people there are cool. They don't suspect anything. Yeah. Apparently no one really had any interaction with Josh. Um, the witnesses, there was like a ton of witnesses here taking big pictures of shit. They, um, they all came out after the fact. This guy was standing near his park he's parked on the wrong side of the road he's parked in the no parking zone right so you didn't cut him a ticket did you no 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 but that adam will be able to write that like he yeah josh is going the wrong way but there were no cars on that side of the road so he when he moved over this car was parked it shouldn't been shouldn't have been there it was you quit it What's that? Are you cool with it? Yeah. Okay. Yep. God damn it. God call our bluff right there and hit me. Yeah, that's fucking, yeah. All right, I emailed you the smaller version of the picture. Okay. Um, if you ever need to do that again, right-click on the picture and go up to edit, then you can lower the percentages. Okay. So if you ever want to send a dick pic, you can also up the percentages. <laughs> All right. All right, later. All right. Thank you. What's up? Did you touch base with Adam anymore? No. Okay. Um, and did he tell – and I, I just remember, I don't, you and I didn't talk about this. Did he tell you – because Adam was on the phone when I got there. Did he call you again? He called me the second time, and we hung up as soon as you were pulling up. Did he tell you that they that guy went to the hospital? Uh, he said he was getting checked out. They lo- he was like laughing and joking around, but they boarded him and transported him. Okay. Yeah. 
for like non. I mean, the guy didn't even. I think he was just like he was him and the girl whose house he was at, where they were just kind of laughing about it. But okay. Um. So I and I it didn't dawn on me that. Maybe Adam didn't relay that to you, but I said that would make a difference. But I assumed but that's where he went. Um, what I did was I sent a text to the old lady because I won't see her tomorrow. Yeah. And I said that he was involved in an accident. He went the wrong way. He got a ticket and had been drinking and was checked on the box. Here's the report number. And yeah. So that's basically how it's going to look when she reads it. She'll ask me about it, and I'll just give her a look like, uh-huh. Right. So. Okay. All right, that's cool. Um, start thinking about when you want to go out for Christmas too. Okay. Without Rawson. <laughs> well, of course. Yeah. Well, fuck, we can invite him. No. Are you not? You're not even gonna invite him? No, but he's not part of the group. No. All right. I might. Well, we should probably get Ubers home just. In light of recent events. Yeah, no shit. Might invite Rogers if she wears yoga pants. Yep. She was part of the shift. Yeah. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Then All right. We'll talk about it later. Yep. All right. Bye. Bye. Hello. Manhole's in here right now. That's good. Um, I was thinking. Uh-oh. Well, if Monica starts doing digging, they're going to want to, they're going to pull footage, aren't they? No. Well, why not? Because I'll fucking tell her not to. Um, she won't want to know. I know she won't. But um, it's not. He's writing a UD10, right? Right. So she can't just. That's not file maker. So she's gonna have to. She's gonna have to ask somebody in traffic. Somebody in traffic's gonna be like, "Why does the prosecutor's office care about this? They're gonna see that. That may turn some heads right there." Uh, I'll take care of that part. She will be smart enough not to dig into it. Okay. I just didn't want her to want to copy the report, not find it, and then figure what the fuck. Right. I'll cover that with her. Okay. Because if she does dig, I'll end up getting a fucking day or two off, and then I'll be really fucking pissed. <laughs> and then I'll go, fucking told you. <laughs> Yeah, I kind of hope she does. I want a fucking argument. Uh, that's funny. Uh, How is the tape? I haven't even watched it. Did you watch it? Okay. But I know there's, I know there's like a, a, a screening or a recording of who watches it and when you watch it and all that shit. Yeah. Okay. Um. Yeah, you got two experienced fucking police officers. I. Yeah, I'm just going to say, fuck, I, I don't even really know Josh, and I didn't fucking smell alcohol on him. They're like, how did you know? I'd be like, I don't fucking know. And you know the smell of alcohol. I do know the smell of alcohol. <laughs> so do I. Yeah. I uh, half the whores I've banged in my whole life as well. That's yeah. a little low. 75% of the whores I've banged in my life. Okay. Uh, 75? Come on. Well, if you figure 25% of the time I was married when I had sex. That's true. <laughs> and they were drunk 10% of the time, maybe. <laughs> right, exactly. <laughs> now it's 100% of the time. <laughs> right. Not even on my birthday, because her birthday's the day before. <laughs> um, And then, uh, worse comes to worse, fucking manhole told me it was Kuiper. I sent you out there, and if they start being assholes, on me. You I don't think, I mean... I know they they won't, but yeah. shit rolls I'll just, it, I'm good with it. Yeah. And I was just telling him we were in the middle of a conversation. <laughs> yeah. About how <laughs> you could get out of it, and this one was harder than Miller. This one was fucking hard. Anybody else? There's probably only another one or two cops out here, other than Adam, that would have been able to discreetly do that, but. Yep. The the first part of his phone conversation to you might fuck up. Yeah, it might. <laughs> but I told him to call 07, it's on me. Yeah. Right. The only one that won't like it would be Kittle. 
Right. The other two well, are the there. there. I mean, it's a it's fucking game. It's just a fucking if who and who knows who Josh is gonna fucking tell. Jesus God. If I stole that dumb son of a bitch, that there's four people in the world that know and no one else needs to. He's he's well aware of that. Right. I mean, I know he understands. I just don't want him to be like, oh my God, uh, blah blah blah. I, I have to thank those guys. They did me a solid. We didn't fucking do them anything. I, I told him that those words never come out of his mouth ever. He never needs to thank anyone, including myself, ever again. Yeah. Unless you get arrested and he's the prosecutor. Yeah, exactly. Unless <laughs> <laughs> we do work some shit down the road. But. So I made sure that he was well aware of that. Whether he remembers that or not, I don't know. So my worry is. Well, well whatever. I'll, we'll deal with it. I didn't sell alcohol. I drove home. I'll I'll handle all that it's without saying not going to yeah. That's what happened. Be a UD 10. Don't ask no more fucking one. questions. Don't dig into it. Right. As long as no one on that end did, then no one hears them look at a UD 10. Exactly. Right. Did you put Adam? Did Adam put had been drinking on the UD 10? I'm going to. Yeah. What does that does that automatically flag it to someone or no? No, the insurance companies, but no one else. Yeah. He, no. Fuck him for the insurance company. Yeah, you're right. right. There. Yeah, and you ran him through sobriety. So it's not like you just fucking swept him up and we got him out of there. Right. And I talked to the other guy at the hospital and let him know that he was below the limit and when we went through things. And he's like, oh, okay, that's fine, you know. So. Did you get, did, that asked you gave that guy a parking ticket for being on the wrong side of the road. <laughs> I did not do that. I didn't want to insult to injury. Like, <laughs> No need to poke the bear. Like. <laughs> All right. Well, good All work. Right.